Hello, everybody. Welcome to Small Chicken. I mean, Chicken Little. We're here. This movie is a <laughs> lot worse than I remember it being. Oh, I remember like the entire movie. I love it so much. I watched it and just unlocked memories. I don't remember that I had. Also, I do have chips. You have them? I don't have chips. Yeah, dude, these are your chips. Why are you eating my chips? Because you left them here. Let's not get into this. Walt Gizney. Walt Dimsney. Is this about to have the Shrek storybook intro for some reason? Where to begin? How about the beginning? How about Once Upon a Time? No. no. Oh, no, no, not the book. How many have seen opening the book before? Can we start? Start the movie. No. Literally, our intro went about as well as this sequence right now. Hello, everybody. Things took a toy for the voice. Why is this panning between my ears? Run for your lives! I know we're like two seconds in, but can we talk about how awful this looks? Yeah, everything's the same brightness everywhere. Also, that building in the background just looks flat. It, it does. Yeah, that is not a real asset. Ooh, why is that one looking right at the camera? I hate that. But yeah, this building um, is brighter than the sky, which is not how that works. Emergency! Oh, that thing, wow. That is the world's strongest wooden ladder that it just goes through a metal frame. The world's weakest metal car. Yeah, that car is made out of cheese and glass. <laughs> That's why it sliced so easily. That is the most rigid cheese. My favorite afternoon snack, cheese and glass. Oh yeah, this is the Indiana Jones joke. I love that it's like targeting people. It has no like set trajectory. It's just like, I want to kill. Look at that, the, the true 4D experience. Genuine question, is the live action movie in an animated universe? universe their equivalent of an animated movie yes they're really good at animation in this universe but the universe itself is not animated well yeah they somehow made their cg look better than real life the sky is falling and it hit me on the head and it looked like a stop sign well look wait What's that? Son, uh, is this what hit you? I love the dad. I love how unreasonably huge he is for a chicken, by the way. Chicken Little being that size makes a lot more sense than his dad, who's just a behemoth big bird monster. Jude, I hear your point there about the sky not being a solid object. Yes. Well, that's why everyone thinks he's crazy. But listen, buddy, listen to me, bub. That was a fake sky, like the sky above us right now. It's fake. The moon projection. This movie's trying to tell us the truth. Every other other planets a sphere but the earth the earth is flat you uh, there's a bumper sticker <laughs> i knew it was only a matter of time hey look it's the adhd bit honestly the last five movies we've watched there's just been a thing in the background of a conversation you can't have a serious conversation in a kid's movie god forbid kids have to put any effort into their brains also yeah you, you talked about the animation earlier these look like they aren't finished this is like the behind the scenes like in the middle of them animating it it looks like marvel's like previous stuff where they like do the really crappy source filmmaking animation of the scene first. What it looks like to me is that they exported the movie and then they didn't like do any color grading on it. Really out here with that Captain America Civil War color. Yeah. Okay. This car is an egg. Uh, you know, it took me 17 years to notice <laughs> that car was an egg. Yeah, you see the car is an egg and the inside is yellow because it's the oak. Does that mean all Prius drivers are chickens, Brent? Yes. <laughs> Why isn't he wearing clothes? He's got a coat. The feathers weren't good enough though, Bren. Uh, or the, the fur on the other animals. Ducky lucky, fuzzy wuzzy, fish out of water. He appears. Oh no. Oh my God. I knew something looked off. Ugh. How hard would it have been to leave him in those five frames you needed? Happy mallard. Ugly duckling. <laughs> Will not tolerate rude behavior at the expense hey, hey, of hey, a fellow. No worries, Mr. Wollensworth. <laughs> she looks just as ugly as every other character in this movie. Literally, she just has teeth. And that's the only thing throwing this off is that she has very visible teeth. You're right. That kid's in braces and a fox. This guy is a sheep. He looks like one of those sponges that like has been used for three years. <laughs> Chicken little. <laughs> Where is that person's eye behind her? Oh, oh, oh. How did you forget an eye? It's a character model. Are we just gonna find like a billion animation mistakes like this awful crap? Oh, absolutely. Calm down, Ron. Just, just do what Fish is doing. <laughs> 
Oh. The song is only good when it's not being played in a movie. No, it's never good because I want you to picture this. You make $8 an hour, first of all. That's where we're starting with this. You're wearing an apron that's a little too warm. And every 25 minutes over the store speakers, distorted and reverbed, you hear everybody dance now while someone's complaining to you about the price of sauce. <laughs> every single day. Why would they play that in a store? I wanted to just jump out the front windows or into the garbage baler. I one of the two. Girls are good at honest communication and sensitivity. I will forever remember the sound of a dodgeball hitting you in the face. That's a sound that stays with you for the rest of your life. It's a sound you feel. That is like the perfect sound. It's like a cartoon sound effect. It's just so absolutely perfect. <gasps> You know those like people on TikTok that collect fire alarms? I'm sorry, what? That's a thing? There's people who collect fire alarms and like the fire alarm strobes and sirens and switches and all this stuff and they like rig it up. Stole an entire fire alarm system instead. Fine, you don't have to explain anything. Okay, we get it, move on. It's so Well, he's a Gemini, so he can't be good at anything, so. He's not a Gemini, he's a chicken. Porcubine, porcupine. It's Morgan time. <laughs> oh my god. Not again. That's two in the hole. One more strike gets a punch out, folks, and we're all going home. Today is a new day. Today is a new day. Hold on. I gotta. Oh. Oh, hey, Joe Rogan. What's going on, man? What? Oh, no. That's not what I was. That sounds like AM uh, radio. That's what that sounds like. Uh, back to the herd with Colin Cowherd. <laughs> This scene lasts like 15 minutes long and it looks like they created this location in like 10 minutes. Yeah, this is some Unity engine with a background crap. That grass is a tile. It's disgusting. One of the key locations in your movie and you could have made it look like a little bit better. The baseball scene is literally like a pivotal point. <coughs> Why is the dirt 4K and everything else is disgusting? <laughs> They can do dirt and hair sometimes. Oh, look, the cow's missing an eye again. Void. You see, it wasn't like that before. Yeah, he's got eyes right there. How did you forget the eyes? Yeah, it's part of the character model, unless it's not. <laughs> Comes back down and they're gone. It's so devoid of life and disgusting. Oh, <sighs> oh geez. You know. Hey, look, it's foreshadowing his blankets and polygonal shapes. Oh, because it's like sky colors as well, too. It's foreshadowing. To the thing that's going to happen in like five minutes. I can't wait for that guy on YouTube shorts. Did you know that in Chicken Little, the bed looks like the sky pattern? And that's the entire video. Yeah, I know what you're talking about. He's like, did you know that in Coco, the name of the movie is, is Coco? He plays guitar, which is an instrument. God's about to send a star at his face at full force and kill him. <gasps> Me, when I was little, seeing an airplane and thinking it was a UFO. A piece of the sky? Shaped like a stop sign? That's not shaped like a stop. It's a hexagon, Chicken Little. I'm looking up what an octagon is. This stop sign is an octagon! <laughs> Never mind. What's the difference? Look, the past is behind us, right? <laughs> Tomorrow's going to be a new day. <laughs> I know he doesn't want to tell his dad that the sky is falling, but like you could show him the piece of alien technology. Yeah, this would literally clear up everything. We wouldn't have a movie if he if he did that. Yes, we would. This is like aliens. That's interesting enough. I mean, we would still literally have the alien invasion. Like, I don't think his dad knowing would change that giant plot happening, but like... Let me guess. You haven't told your dad yet. Well, there hasn't been any you, your dad, talk, talk, no, no, talking. No, talk. There was talking. There was there was definitely talking. He legitimately talked to his dad. That's why I dislike this character, because she thinks she's like the authority. And she's like 12. Well, actually, she's 36 uh, based on her voice. Well, I mean, that's like her character flaw. It's not supposed to be like something you like about her. What's the good thing about her? It's like her redeeming quality. She is there to be the love interest for, I forget, Chicken's and Little's name. Is it just Chicken Little? It is literally Chicken Little. His name is is chicken. They got so creative. His first name is chicken. And last name little. 
This is why Fish is amazing is because he just never speaks. And I wish nobody in this movie could speak. Yeah, you wish it was like minions where there's like barely any actual speech. I love the idea of that glow stick scraping through all those panels for some reason. Chicken Little has something to tell you. Tell him. He can handle it. Did you not notice the power go out? It only went out in his room. The panel through that single breaker. <laughs> it's like my basement. Yeah, except you're like overhead light was off, but then your Xbox turned on, but then my phone couldn't charge. The AC might have been on, but the rest of the house was off. I really want to plug a hair straightener into a random outlet of your house. Ooh. <laughs> Wow. We should get another movie about tornadoes with more tornadoes. It should be named Mornado. There's never been another tornado movie in the history of movies. No, it should be two NATO. Three NATO. Um, by the time you get to the ninth one, as to respect Fast and Furious, it'll just be T9. <laughs> Oh, snap. Is he the only one with a normal name? Because other than him, we have duckling, fish, and chicken. And then runt. Why wasn't he just like pig? Piggy wiggy. Fish. 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 <sighs> the only thing that isn't doll in this movie. There he is, the little dude. Okay, Jude, why do I think of your cat every time I see those? They act very similar in that they are the most obnoxiously chaotic beings in the world. <laughs> I can't handle the pressure. Yeah. Oh, God. <laughs> Just leave me some ammo, a little water, some, some chips, chips if you have them. Runt is the best part of this movie. I think the best part of this movie is like the credits. I, I looked up Chicken Little to find out who the VA for Rent was and it defaulted to Chicken Little 1943. 1943? Yep. Steve Zahan. Uh, he's the dad from uh, Diary of a Wimpy Kid, which you should watch that video if somehow you haven't already. Oh, he was in Tall Girl 2, the movie of all time. Wait, there was two of them? Yes. I didn't even know there was one. I would say, um, let us know if you want us to watch Tall Girl, but it's just a boring movie. <laughs> Wait, next. <laughs> That sound is really great. <laughs> that is such a nice thud. Whoever did the folly for this movie was on top of it though. Yeah. I can't wait for everyone to be disappointed in Chicken Little because for some reason the aliens can move at Mach 5 when it's convenient. It's the highest pitch things to them, apparently. Bing. 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 No one uses Bing anymore. Josiah, we're doing this call on MSN Messenger. What are you talking about? We use Bing all the time. Um, Thomas still uses Bing. Well, Thomas is wrong. Uh, So we've got anchovies and Bing. That's strike two, Thomas. That better have been for a joke, Thomas. Please let us know. If you use Bing, you're done. I would take... Duck, duck, go before Bing. Everyone here uses Yahoo like a real person. Be a man. Come on. Come on, hurry up, please. Look at right What are we looking for? Field. I like how the camera guy was like, I better look up at the commentary box. That's the best place. Dad! Dad! I'm not making this up. You gotta believe me this time. No. It's the chicken who cried wolf. <laughs> That's really a chicken in sheep's clothing. I love looking at this grass texture. He looked at the book that said talk because it wasn't clear that him and his dad have no communication. Closure. Like, stop. Don't you say it. Don't if you say it. there was ever a time to talk to your dad. Closure. Closure. Baby, now it's too late. But he really didn't try to make it. Runt. <laughs> Talks in song lyrics. It's amazing. I genuinely love that his face turned like a color of red during that. That's the one animation thing they did that I was like, yeah, that's kind of funny. Here, blow. Are you made of trains? <laughs> what is that sound? What? He is indeed constructed from trains. That's the weirdest sound to use for that. I try to think of the logistics of something made out of trains now. There's an entire alien civilization just above them. Okay, I love the aesthetic of the sky coming apart like that. That's one of the really nice visual things in this movie that I think is kind of cool. I like a liminal space like that. Ha! I gotcha! You finally kill that gnat that's been tormenting you every video for the last year. One of like four. Though given his track record, we understand why you don't believe him! I hate how slow they run. Everyone just runs. It feels like Madden, where it's just way too slow for the animation. Oh! <laughs> oh! 
How, how are they not finding this child? Like, look at these lights. Literally, they're going everywhere but the orange ball of hair on the ground. Yeah, he's the brightest thing in the shot. He's brighter than the spotlights. If you've noticed, instead of, like, being stationary and using their search lights, they're like, we fly. <laughs> There's like 50 of these ships. They have enough to see if this kid's there, but they're like everywhere. I didn't realize, son. Oh, wow. The conflict is resolved this quickly, by the way. Hey, you know what movie that we recently made fun of that did this whole... Uh, Cloudy? Yep, Cloudy did this way better. And it was earned. Your mom, she, she was, you know, she, she was always good with stuff like this. She, yeah, this exact line right here, too. The thing about Cloudy was they accepted that they're different, and in this movie, he's just like, sorry. That chicken reminds me of Billy Joel for no reason at all. <laughs> Come on, Dad. We've got a planet to save. We've got a planet to save. Wow. By the way, I'd like to say I've always found you extremely attractive. People with bills kissing sounds like the worst thing ever. She just snaps her spine around in a really awful way. Oh, that's closure. Stop saying closure. We're going to close your face. That was the shock from the whiplash she experienced. Oh, they've given her an alien mind wipe. Ah! Ah! His <laughs> screams are just me. Uh-oh. No chickens. Like you just saw what you needed. Just take it and leave. Do they not have like infrared scanners or anything? No. Hey, where's the USB drive that gives the kid back to the parents? That would make this perfect. <laughs> they take away the USB drive from the mothership and all the other aliens shut down. Yeah. Ew. Ow. Ew. Ew. And ow. How is this like a Disney like animated movie? Disney's made a lot of garbage. You know that. No, they haven't. They have only ever made perfect movies and never have made a mistake. Good Luck Charlie exists. Specifically the Good Luck Charlie movie, which was terrible. Like the show I can forgive because it's like okay for a decom, but the movie is awful. It's terrible. Release the child. Uh, oh, okay. 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 Sweetheart. Oh, Kirby, I'm so happy. She's like the most Midwestern alien ever. Why is that a trapezoid? Because trapezoids are like half of another shape. Oh, look, another camera bouncing. Also, what movie did this first? Ah, uh, that's a really good question. Someone in the comments without sounding like the nerd emoji, tell us. Uh, actually, you know, uh, the very first movie that did this, uh, it was in like 19, whatever, I don't care. You can say anything you want to as long as you don't put the words fun fact in front of it. Or actually. I suppose I should put, put the big guns away? Yes, yes. Welcome to Murder Trivia Party. Turn it off. No. Ha, hi, uh... Anyone want to try the big voice? I do have a big voice, but I can make it even bigger. <laughs> Abby, at least I still have you. I hate this part. Abby. Ace. Abby. Ace. Stop. I don't hate this movie. It's part of my childhood. I just think the animation's garbage. It's so slow. It's really dull, like the colors and like the lighting. When I was watching it, I was just like kind of bored the entire time. I think uh, like video games, we should get full on remakes of animated movies now from the ground up. Just keep the dialogue and go from there. I'm surprised that isn't a thing. Maybe it will be in like 20 years. Disney will do that. I guarantee you if any company's gonna pull that crap, it's the company that decided we wanted to see lions in live action. Well, if you guys like ugly things, you should check out the video where we found the world's most cursed places. If you know of any other dumb animated movies we can watch and rip into, uh, put a comment down below this video. Or tweet it at us at Society of mm. I would prefer it facts. <laughs> Hit me up at my contact email, sharkboy at Is that real? That was real. Have a day.